Hey guys, it's Kaylin. I'm back with another video. Today we're going to be doing a little bit of a self-care Sunday. I'm someone who likes to normally be a go, 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 be super productive, but some days I really like to rest, relax, do absolutely nothing. I try and balance my weekends and at least have one day where I really do nothing, just chill, relax, and that's what we're doing today. I want to go to Starbucks, get a coffee, get my nails done, do some reading, and not much else beyond that. I might work on a little bit of book content stuff just because I really enjoy it and I like making TikTok, so that's kind of something that gives me energy and joy and so it really feels like some form of self-care to me. I might also rearrange my bookshelves because my books are getting a little bit out of hand. Again, something that brings me joy, but it's getting a little bit of a chaotic mess on my bookshelf. So maybe we'll reorganize that as well, but really nothing too crazy. Just a pretty chill, relaxed Sunday in my life and I thought I would take you along. Brian's currently making us breakfast, eggs, bacon, and toast. So I'm gonna go eat that and then I'm gonna head out, go to Starbucks, get myself a coffee, coffee and then I go get my nails done. I'm really excited about it. It's been a hot minute since I got my nails done and they're very grown out. So we're just going to treat ourselves today. I have a nice chill relaxed day and I'm really looking forward to it. We got the full spread, bacon, eggs, toast. This looks good. Thanks for breakfast. You. <laughs> okay, getting my fanny pack with all the stuff that I need. I'm going to put it under my sweater actually. Um, and then what else do I need? I have my cash in here already for my nails. I have my wallet. Let's stick my Kindle in here. Headphones for when I'm walking. And I need my phone and I think that's it. So we are going to head out, go to Starbucks, get our nails done. Quick fit check. I have a body crop and espresso from Set Active Lululemon Leggings. My sweater is Hanes from Kohl's and then we've got our everywhere belt bag from Lululemon too. So that is a fit and then I'm just gonna wear Birkenstocks because I wear those everywhere. Gonna grab my phone and then head out. I'm so excited to get my nails done. It'll feel so nice once that's done and coffee too so let's go I just got back from getting coffee and getting my nails done. I just kind of relaxed and chilled at Starbucks for a little bit while I read my book and drank my coffee and then walked, got my nails done. It took forever. The lady was just like doing it very slowly, but they look really, really good. So I cannot complain. She definitely took her time, but they look so good. So I'm very happy about that. I almost fell asleep sitting there, but I did get a little bit of reading done. I have like an hour and a half left in this book and I really want to finish it because it's really good. I also need to post the review tomorrow. So I want to make sure I finish it up today and maybe start another book after that too I do need to take a few book pictures so that I can post the reviews um, I need to post two or three I think so I'm gonna try and at least take the pictures so I can catch up between today and tomorrow right now I'm not feeling like reorganizing on my bookshelves But maybe if I chill for a little bit finish this book then I will get some motivation to do that But for now, I'm just gonna chill and relax and enjoy my Sunday finished the book that I was reading. The ending was really, really cute. And I took the few book pictures that I needed to get done so I can write those reviews and post them. I want to start another book, but I honestly have no idea what book to start. I have so many books on my TBR and so many books I can read right now that I'm a little stressed about picking which one to start next. So I think I'm gonna take a little bit of a break. I need something to eat, probably not like a full meal because it's a little bit too late for lunch before we eat dinner, but I need to eat something because I'm hungry. So I'm gonna find something to eat and then I might actually work on my bookshelves I just have I just have way too many books all over the place that need to be kind of organized more on my shelves So I think we're gonna do that and then hopefully by then I can figure out what book I want to pick up next and yeah That's my plan for the next little bit. Okay, here are my bookshelves right now I'm basically going to move around at these top shelves to try and fit some more of these stacks of books on them That way the whole like top three can be romance books for the background of my tiktoks and then other books can go 
go over here. This top one is all like self-help personal development books and I think I'm gonna move that to that one shelf there so that they can like all line up because they do actually fit pretty perfectly. And then I don't know what I'm gonna do with the extra stack of books because there will still be a stack of books that don't fit anywhere so I might just have to like shove them at the bottom there but we're just trying to make do. I just don't want to buy a bigger bookshelf or anything because I think we're gonna move like this summer and so I'm just gonna try and make this work for now but I'm gonna work on rearranging these shelves. I think I'm gonna keep this one to like family and small town romance series. The top I think I'm gonna try like to put all the spicy spicy books and then this one will be like a random mix of other stuff. Okay let's try and figure this out and see where everything is going to fit and we'll see how long this takes us. Hopefully not that long. Okay, here is my completed bookshelf for now. It's definitely a lot better than it was. I feel like it's pretty well organized for like the amount of books I have and like the variety of books I have, if that makes sense. I tried to keep the top row to like the spiciest books. There's some Mafia, MC, and then just other pretty spicy books I have. Sorry, the lighting is kind of crappy. Here I have Small Town Romance and like Interconnected Friends series, if that makes sense. Um, The initiation doesn't really fit there, but I really love that cover and wanted it to still show so that is there and then I have Twisted Love and Twisted Games because they don't really fit anywhere else so I put them there and then this is kind of like a more random shelf just general romance I wish I could fit trouble up on that shelf there with the rest of Tia Louise's book but I want to show off the cover because that one's really pretty too so it's not perfect like I said but it's a lot better I think and I'm sure I'll get new books and have to like rearrange things again but it's a lot better than it was and then instead of having like 50 different stacks of books I just put one giant one over there so the bottom shelf is kind of a disaster but at least it's somewhat more like in in one place instead of all over so it could be a lot worse and then all my self-help personal development books are on that shelf so it's a lot better than it was I almost just fell over but yeah that is my bookshelf if I get more books I honestly might stack some up at the top and move our diplomas somewhere else we'll see what ends up happening the lighting again is just all over the place but there is my bookshelf so my bookshelf is done got that organized I also talked to my grandma she called me so I just chatted with her for a little bit it's always really nice to call and talk to people you haven't talked to in a while that's like another important part of self-care especially people you don't see all the time and then what else did I do oh I have been trying to congregate a list of authors for this book conference that I bought tickets to in October it's in Vegas I really want to go I'm really excited about it so I bought tickets I still have to figure out some of the details but I really want to go really excited and I decided that I wanted to read a lot more of the authors that are going I've read quite a few of them and really enjoy all the ones I have read but I want to like read more of the authors that are going to be there so I made a list on Amazon and tried to add a few books from each of the authors that I haven't read yet or ones from authors that are going that I know I enjoy I just haven't read all of their books yet or a lot of their books yet so I added those all to a list so I can slowly make my way through them over the next few months if that makes sense before that conference I also think I decided on what book I want to start next it's a series that I read last year that I absolutely love and it like kind of branches off into a few different series for some reason I stopped reading it like part way through or like two-thirds of the way through I think it was just because it was a lot of books I think there's like 20 something books in total with like all the interconnected series and branching off and branching off bits so I am going back to it and picking up the next book from where I left off I'm really excited because I really like the series and it's kind of a shorter and it's kind of a shorter and just like mostly a spicy book too so I think that will kind of get me through this like weird feeling of where I don't know what to read next and then I can hop in into another like solid book after that I'm pretty sure that's what I'm gonna do I'm gonna hop into my book right now Brian's gonna come home and make dinner a little bit he went on a walk I should probably go on a walk too but I'm really not feeling it so we're just going to chill, read, enjoy our evening. last part of my self-care Sunday is prepping myself to have a great start to my work week, to my Monday. I wrote out my to-do list for tomorrow, everything that I need to get done. I have my gym outfit all laid out and then my keys, my gym card, everything too. So tomorrow morning I can get up early and go work out and have a great start to my week.
pretty much all I've done since I last talked to you is read and I really meant to do a little bit more towards self-care than that this evening but it didn't really happen. I've just been reading for the last several hours. I'm like 50% through this book or a little bit less than 50%. It's a shorter one so it's not taking me very long to get through and I'm really enjoying it. Didn't do much else. But that's okay because to me a nice chill evening of reading is a great way to end off my weekend and get ready for a new week. Overall we had a pretty good self-care Sunday. Getting coffee, getting my nails done, rearranging my books. Books are very important if you couldn't tell. But I think that's about it for my self-care Sunday. My chill relaxing weekend day. I'm gonna read for just a few more minutes and then head to bed try and get a good night of sleep before we start work and everything tomorrow morning. If you like this video, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up, leave any comments down below, and subscribe to my channel if you are new. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it, and I will see you guys in my next one.